Hey, Brayden, what's up? Hi, Suraj. How's it going? Pretty good. How are you? Great to see you. Do you mind if I ask you 67 questions? Oof, yeah, let's do it. Cool. Let's go for a walk. Yeah. How'd you get into work today? Believe it or not, I took a lift. Favorite part of the software stack? Hmm. Uh, I really enjoy building front-end data visualizations. Favorite thing about working at Lyft? I love our secret hidey holes all across the office. What was the last project you worked on at Lyft? Uh, I've been managing our data warehouse migration over to Hive. Brayden, who's your favorite professor? <laughs> Oh, uh, my favorite professor that I never actually had as a professor would be Peter Singer. <laughs> Thanks. If you could spend an evening with one famous person, who would it be? Um, someone that I've always wanted to have dinner with would be uh, Nick Bostrom, and I'd love to chat about AI. Do you play any sports? Uh, I haven't played any sports since I used to play field hockey back in Australia. Do you miss being a student at the University of Melbourne? Uh, you know, I thought it was fine, but I really prefer working in industry. What music genre are you currently into? Uh, I listen to a lot of chill slash ambient. Is there a programming language that you really like? Really like? Um, you know, I work mostly in SQL and Python, but uh, I'd say Python's pretty flexible. What about a language you really don't like? You've got to be MATLAB. <laughs> used way too much of that at uni. How are you liking San Francisco? Um, San Francisco is the best city that I've ever lived in. What's something you've built with machine learning? Getting <laughs> Hi. Um, I've, uh, what's something I've built with machine learning? Well, I can't tell you about confidential projects, but, uh, but I've built a, uh, an operations model. What's the most beautiful thing in the world? <laughs> the most beautiful thing in the world would have to be um, would have to be watching sunrise with a friend. Do you miss your hometown? Uh, yeah, I really miss my family, but my friends all moved out to SF, so I'm pretty lucky there. Programming language of choice for machine learning? Definitely Python. What website do you waste time on? Big time waste is Hacker News. Last person you emailed? Uh, I emailed a candidate who is looking for data engineering jobs. You get an all expenses paid trip to one city. Where do you go? I wish that they would just pay for me to stay in San Francisco, honestly. This is a pretty good spot. Would you visit Mars? Uh, that depends on the price and how much of the Earth technology is available on Mars. What is one thing that excites you? Uh, what is one thing that excites me? So I'm really interested in how you can use data to like improve policy decisions in the world. What is one thing you're afraid of? Gosh, irrelevance. Best advice you've ever received? Uh, choose the people you surround yourself by very intentionally. What's a big misconception about you? Uh, I think that it's very easy for people to look like they've got it all worked out when really they've got no idea what's going on. What's the bravest thing you've ever done? Probably moving out to San Francisco without a job and trying to, trying to get established here. It's tough. What is one piece of advice you'd give yourself 10 years ago? Uh, I think just keep doing what you're doing. If you were a Pokemon, who would it be? Uh, I would be Mew because then you could learn all of the moves. Do you have any pets? None. What's something you've learned in the past month? Oh, I really enjoyed the Neuralink article on brain-computer interfaces. What's a topic in machine learning you'd like to explore more? Uh, let's see, a topic in machine learning. I would really love to learn more about self-driving car autonomy. Do you think we'll solve intelligence in your lifetime? I hope I live long enough to see that happen. If you ran the world, what is one thing that you would enact? One law? One law that I would enact would be listen to your economists. Who is one person you looked up to when you were in college? Um, in college, uh, I guess it was Bill Gates. Seems to be doing some pretty impactful stuff. What were you like as a kid in grade school? Probably pretty weird and annoying. What deep learning library besides TensorFlow do you like? Besides, no, it's, it's TensorFlow. It's the only one. What's something that excites you about the future? Um, gosh, uh, 
just we, we live in like the most exciting time so everything about the future is is an open book what is one major unsolved research problem you'd love to see tackled um, so there was some really interesting research in the uh, how to get alignment correct with AI I, I would love to see more research there What's more interesting, generative models or discriminative models? I think there's a lot of business problems right now that you can solve with discriminative models. If you could be a superhero, who would it be? Uh, superhero. Uh, is Ozymandias a bad answer? What's your spirit animal? Spirit animal would have to be a bat. Favorite computer scientist? Um, I don't know if this counts as a computer scientist, but uh, Richard Feynman was pretty cool. If you had a time machine, when would you visit? Well, uh, I would love to fast forward in time and try to get to the other side of the great filter. Do you still use Uber? <laughs> <laughs> the last time I used Uber was when I was traveling internationally. Android or iPhone? Android. What would surprise people about life at Lyft? Um, I think you're just, you've, you're given a lot of responsibility. Favorite Linux distro? Ubuntu is pretty user friendly. Have you ever been in love? Yeah, luckily enough. What's the point of life? Oh my god. <laughs> um, to, uh, to, like, to make the world a better place and to be happy. Have you ever built an app with machine learning that you use in your day-to-day -day life? You know, I haven't, but I would really love to build a app that helps you manage your friendships and let you know who you should be messaging when. If you were to start from scratch today, what is a learning resource you would use to learn machine learning? Uh, I would use the Open Science Data Masters. Open Data Science Masters. What is something you do to relax? I drink tea with my housemates. Awesome. Well, thanks, Braden, for answering those questions. <laughs> yeah, no worries, Siraj. All right, have a good one. Have a good one.